all right, all right, all right. This last video, and then we going, you know, it's already 11 11. I mean, I ain't going to school tomorrow, so I ain't tripping. Aaron requests to meet to meet with Danny unhappy. With all right, Aaron will Aaron requests to meet with Danny unhappy with not being in his videos anymore. This is just one of three meetings that took place July 6, 2021. They were all recorded. I just don't like when you start, just start threatening me, like saying I'm like taking advantage of you and shit. Yeah. It just kind of, kind of bothers me, so I don't want to be put in that situation again. Gotcha. To be honest. Because that's not how it ever was in any way. Yeah. So are we like, are we just done? Are we done filming each other? Uh, I mean, it's not like a, we never film again. I don't think it's like that. I'm not like how we used to, for sure not. I just got to figure out how to like, what, what's, what's next? Like, what do I do? You just make your own videos. Do good shit. I got to play smart. I gotta play a game. I gotta play the. I gotta play the LA game. I guess for a little bit. I just gotta do it. I What's the LA game? What, what uh, everyone else does. I mean, to be honest, I might be on. Like, I don't know. I, th I think I'm good at like starting drama. That's my focus on starting drama. I think. Like, yeah. What the fuck, bro? You got caught up, nigga. You ain't check for cameras, bro. They done mic'd up, bro. They mic'd up, bro. Damn. All right. So if for those who don't know what happened, uh, Danny Duncan. A.K.A. Danny Duncan um, has some allegations that he was abusing this guy named Aaron. And then he made a video saying it was like verbal abuse. He was scared because he was choking him out, threatening to kill him. And he didn't want to say no to him because I don't know. I felt like they definitely had something sexual going on. But uh, that video was a couple days ago. Blah, blah, blah. I don't know if niggas try to cancel Danny Duncan. Some guy like that, like, he really just, he, like, you really can't just cancel him because he, like, kind of, like, don't give a fuck. But, uh, this is the same guy. They released this video after him. So, apparently, he you not know saying it. Like, they got the so recorders. Yeah, so, I mean, I, I, I've been doing that for a long time from the beginning. I'm going to go back to that. It's calm for a while. I have no, I don't have a filter. I, just, I will say anything. Say so, you definitely don't want to start around. No, I'm good at it, though. I just one thing good at. No, you're not. Yes, I am. I, I don't have a filter. I will see anything online. That's the thing. I don't care. I will talk about gay so I don't, I don't care. Yeah. I don't have a filter. Dude, it's not good. You know, that's going to do it. I have to. Well, I'm just not going to I don't know, bro. I don't know about this recording. It's trying to make, like, Danny seem like the hero. But in what, the way he was talking spicy, it's like, Danny's a bitch. Like, I don't... I, I, I don't know. You was a crap. Imagine you doing YouTube for five years and you're still seeing it. I guarantee you'd be losing your mind at me. And that makes you so, like, mad. It's what crazy. All you're going to do is make yourself me. sad and mad it is, and, it is right. and pissed off. Well, you're not entitled to 5 yeah. million followers tomorrow. Oh, well, you gotta do I got to make money, man. So... What, so what, what do you think I should do? Make good videos. But all I'm here right now is plastic wrap around the mic. Plastic wrap. Plastic wrap around the mic. 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 Alright, fuck that. A few months later. So he was trying to start a fake drama. I got it. It just makes me sick talking about this between me and Danny. Why aren't you in his videos anymore? Well, no one will confront him besides me. If I don't, other people are gonna get hurt. And next thing you know, he starts just punching at me. Out of nowhere, all I saw was a big flash, like a big light. Bam, bam. I'm not <laughs> the only one. I've seen too much. It doesn't hurt anyone else, man. Bro, why, do, why did he put it. that flash it's in there? It's not worth it. I'm not the only one. Mm, I'm not just making this video do to try to expose Danny. What would that do for me? Total subscribers weekly. Video subscribers the last 30 days. Support the channel. And Danny, you can say whatever you want to say, but as long as you're honest. Just like I've been honest this whole time, I want you to be honest as well. I just want people to know the truth. That's it. That's all I want, period. You hear about Aaron? What's your Look, thoughts? What happened to him? What happened? He's trying to cancel me. How the hell cancel you? This is what, here, I'll show you. I'll show you the headline, hold on. <laughs> the truth about Danny Duncan. Danny Duncan physically abusing employees. What the fuck? <laughs> That's some pussy ass shit. Roger, it's funny, like, Roger just has no idea any of this is going on. <laughs> but, like, in our life, it's just the only thing talked about right now. Oh, you haven't seen the video either. I haven't seen the video. No, you want to watch it? Watch it. 
Well, I'm gonna put this on my second channel because my main channel isn't really made for drama. I'm not gonna wear this hat for this video today. <laughs> this it's guy, dude. It. it seems as phony as hell, bro. <laughs> There's like someone behind the camera with a gun. <laughs> I was already friends with a lot of YouTubers before them. He had me unfollow all of them, which, which to me uh, was really weird. and I didn't like it. He's not gonna help me if, if I don't do what he says. I'm not begging you to sign a contract. I don't give a fuck if you sign a contract or not. You're the one who wanted to make it. You're the one who wanted help. You're the one who wanted me to help you blow the fuck up. And oh, that's, yeah. that's what I did. I, I made Danny. sure you succeeded. That's it. Commercial as far Danny. as unfollowing people go, Commercial. I never once was like, Aaron, you better unfollow these people or else. I just think it looks cleaner when you're following less people, that's it. And I don't think it matters if you're not following friends. Like, who gives a fuck? If you're friends with someone and you don't follow them on Instagram and they're no longer your friend because you don't follow them on Instagram, they're, they were never your friends. I look at Instagram as a business. It is a business. That's how we make money, all the social media. So that's kind of why I just kept my shit at zero just to like separate, I guess, like personal, personal and business. Like, Instagram's a business. For Aaron, Instagram is a business. So YouTube's a business. It's, it just is. Him making a exposing uh, the truth video about me is a business. It's gonna it's gonna get views. It's gonna make him money. You know what I mean? So yeah, he's been working on this video for months and months and months and months and months. I've known about it, and of course he's gonna post it. You know, in December, which is the best month of the year for monetization. Next thing you know, he starts just punching at me out of nowhere. All I saw was a big flash, like a big light. Dude, it's like, bro, this is a joke. Me and Aaron wrestle, I, we, we do jujitsu, we do wrestling. Aaron's knee David in the stomach. Hey, hey, hey! Oh, God. Oh, God. Hey! hey. <laughs> no, Aaron, you kind of choked. Obviously, Aaron's choked Nick. Oh! Oh, my God! Oh, yeah, they was serious He's in that video. Him, dude. Oh, <laughs> Do I remember when he kicked me in the head? Do I remember when he kicked me in the head? No, come on, that's fucked up, dude. I've wrestled with Aaron like we choke each other. That's what happens. I've never violently hit Aaron in a mean way where I'm trying to like knock him out or something. It just, I've never done it. I never fucking struck him in the face. Like, no, no, you know what I mean? It's the only thing we ever did was just friendship, fucking around with each other. That's it. I mean, that's kind of why I haven't replied. Like, I don't even know how to. Yeah, you should reply, man. You don't get I have this mother. See, it's like, bro, those them touchy ass niggas. I used to know a touchy. Like a touchy ass friend. Obviously, uh, I I I I just hate touchy people, bro. Like, I know a nigga touch like if a, like uh, that shit be pissing me off. Like, friends always want to wrestle and shit. Like, I low key think they gay. Like, why you trying to touch on me, bro? I'm a boy, bro. You a boy, bro. We ain't gotta be two boys touching on each other, nigga. Back the fuck up. But I, f Danny was definitely a you know a touchy ass nigga. Like eight, eight, I actually think I abused this kid. I'm like, what the fuck? Ma imagine you keep run, punching a dog. The one time, you know, you go pet the dog and it flinches. That's what I feel like with Danny. Oh. Speaking of fucking dog, you this motherfucker left my dog in the fucking cage for fucking days, dude. This motherfucker almost killed my dog. Aaron did. <laughs> Dylan. Aaron almost killed him. We had to literally eat the cereal outside. We had to, we had to be so quiet. Because I knew if I made any type of noise, I was so scared he was going to come down and beat me. Dude, <laughs> shut the fuck up, hey, bro. No, that's just what funny, the though. fuck? This dude is out of his mind. He makes a mess with everything. Okay, when he showers, he doesn't use a towel, so him and Kelsey have their own room with a bathroom. Dude, there was like so much water damage on the fucking floor, it was like just destroyed. Brand new house, like we just got it. Fucking water damage everywhere. I mean, dude, he just makes a mess. I am a dick at times, I'm not, I'm not gonna ever deny that. This is Aaron walking around the house, dude. Upstairs, dude, like, you know those memes, those videos where it's like, what the fuck are they doing up there? This is how I'd handle it. I mean, I'm not saying this is the best way, but I'm not a fucking abuser and I don't beat him. I'd be like, dude, Aaron, shut the fuck up. What, dude? Ugh. I'm not, I'm not stomping. You're the only fucking person up there, dude. Aaron, shut the fuck up. I don't want to be a dick. I'd just be like, yo, Andrew, can you tell uh, Aaron to, you know, stop fucking stomping? And Andrew would message him like, yo, stop stomping. And Aaron's like, I'm not stomping. He's like, you're Yo, stop stomping. All right, hold up. <clears throat> September 29th, 2020. Yo, can you stop stomping, please? Dude, I wasn't even moving. I haven't moved in an hour. Bro. Oh, shit, I meant, but no one else was upstairs. Dude, I wasn't freaking moving. And if I did, I wasn't stomping. Don't you have work to do? Lama Fof. Lama Fof. You're the only, you're later, Aaron, you're the only person upstairs. Like, you're stomping. Lama, when I was in the bathroom. Fow. Lim I asked him for a favor, next thing you know, he put a knife right to my throat. This sounds like a porno, like intro. I was against the wall in his bathroom, just me and him. <laughs> but yeah, I never pulled a knife on him. He stabbed me. Well, he didn't stab me. But 
Because right now, I feel like I'm doing the biggest thing that anyone's ever done in your team. And that's by confronting you. How is this confronting me? Couldn't you just come talk to me? Like we did three fucking times and you never brought any of this up one time? Because none of this happened. And I encourage those who have gotten hurt to come forward. Don't hurt anyone else, man. Just don't do it. It's not worth it. I know no one else looking forward, but I'm gonna keep messaging everyone and try to get them to come forward. The verbal abuse he did to me. Even about my teeth, how my teeth are messed up. He always made fun of something. He always had to make, he always had to put me down about something. But I was never putting him down. I was literally just trying to help him. It's like people talk shit about my teeth. I don't care like that this is chipped. I just feel, I care if my teeth are healthy. That's, that's the only thing I'm saying. But I can sit there and talk to him and smell his breath and it just, you know that he didn't brush his teeth. I'm like, Aaron, did you brush your teeth today? No. But I never am like, oh, why do you got fucked up teeth? I literally would just say like, Bro, you have to brush your teeth every fucking day. It's like, there's no excuse for that. You're 24 years old. And like with him, I offered, I said, How many times a day do we really brush our teeth? As a kid, I ain't brush my teeth for shit. But you're supposed to do in the morning, in the afternoon. Like, okay, that whole thing was stupid. Like, you want, like, I'm chilling on the game. Oh, fuck. It's. Six o'clock. Let me get my teeth brushed. That I never did. That. I only brush my teeth twice a day. I don't know. Three times. Niggas say people say they brush their teeth three times a day, bro. You're fucking lying. You're not. You're not getting up in the middle of your day, or you're not out and you're about to go home. It's like, hey, bro, I gotta go home real quick. I gotta brush my teeth. Like that's like you know what I'm saying. When you get home, you're not thinking about, oh fuck, it's six o'clock. Like you ain't setting alarms for this shit. Like that's what I'm saying though. Like at night before I go to bed in the morning. You should be good, I said, you know. Said, Aaron, look, we can take you to a dentist, and I and I said I will pay to get his teeth fixed. Tell myself, I forgive Danny, I forgive him, I forgive him. And when I first said that was you, you think you were watching. Seven thousand seven thousand seven thousand seven thousand. 77,000 people liked the video. The answer to this question, why am I on these videos anymore, is because of all this. It all added up. That is not why you're not in the videos, bro. Bro, this man begged me to be in the videos, dude. The reason he's not in the videos is because he literally said, uh, I feel like you're suge knighting me. So once he said that, I was like, what the fuck is wrong with it? Like, what is he doing, dude? Why is he being weird, you know? He wanted to talk to everyone, so we all got together and Shug talked to him. Suge has like, a what fucking the term now? Verb. When an asshole steals from... In... Okay. When an asshole steals from, intimidates... Beats or copy someone for their own personal gains. What the fuck is wrong with it? Like, what is he doing, dude? Why is he being weird, you know? He wanted to talk to everyone, so we all got together and talked to him. I have okay. the footage. We filmed it. He okay. never once said anything about a bullshit knife. He never said anything about this stuff. He just said that the contract was ripping him off. Well, I mean, it's not like a... I mean, we never filmed again. I don't think it's like that. So what's there? I don't think... Uh, I'm not like how we used to, for sure not. I just don't like when you start threatening me, like, saying I'm, like, taking advantage of you and shit. It just kind of bothers me. Now, this is all after he's saying he's had Play enough. Play the rest of that clip. Never come film Play the rest of that yet he's asking, Where are the we going to film again? I'm on a 10-year contract. I, I'm not allowed to collaborate with anyone, really, because that's part of the contract. Bro, you're not listening. You're not listening. You are basically saying right now that I didn't let you collab with people. I've never told you not to collab with people. I just told you not to collab with these lame people. Never once have said, Aaron, why'd you collab with that person? Not one time. Okay. I'm giving him 20% of my earnings. I didn't take his money. I told him to take the 20% and invest in the stocks. I had him download like a, a Robinhood or an app like that. I told him to buy Apple stocks. I told him, I even told him if he lost any money in Apple that I would give him the money back. But if you I, lose any money on Apple, I'll give it back to you. No, that's not. I mean, you I lose money. Hopefully not. I'm gonna lose money. You will not lose money. I made him invest the 20% into stocks so that it would help him like learn for future because whenever someone gets paid, you need to take money and invest it every time, no matter what. Obviously, yeah, if the motherfucker in five years made 100 million a year, I wouldn't mind taking some of the money. Of course, that's fair. But it was also the, the, the verbal abuse he did to me. He calls me an idiot. He can't, he, he he can't, can't dibble dabble, bro. If he making a thousand a year, nigga, you taking your percent. If you taking, you know what I'm saying, 100 million, you gotta take it. He can't comprehend anything. Or, no, 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 I see what you're saying. I do I know what you things mean. Build, it's hard man. It's it's like, oh, gosh, I That's why I feel bad for him, because it's like he can't, so he can't like, communicate with us. You just sometimes can't comprehend things and just do whatever you want and you think it's better, you think it's better than it is, but it's not. This is what I'm saying though, it's like when he says I'm like calling, what did he say? He said I said he doesn't understand, he can't comprehend it. But he says it like I'm talking shit to him and like I'm mentally abusing him and like putting him down. It's like I'm not at all. So what's I do? 
I gotta, Dude, be I, yourself. I gotta switch my channel. No, I can't. I gotta switch my channel. I gotta, I gotta do something different. I have witnessed abuse firsthand. Like, growing up, I've seen it. I mean, a lot of you guys know I'm sober, and, like, a big reason I'm sober is because, like, uh, my mom was alcoholic. She married a guy who's alcoholic. And then as a kid, you know, for fucking like 10 years, I would watch her get beat all the time, fights all the time. It's just something I would never, I would never if do. I, I never want to like be a part I'll of that. And I, I never want to be put oh. in an environment like that. I never want to create an environment like that. I have, no I have no filter. I'll say anything. I have no filter. Those man said, I have no filter, I'll say anything. No fucking shit you will. He said, I was scared to do too much noise, Daniel would come down and beat me. Bro, <laughs> god damn. This man said, like, bro, what the fuck, dude? He said I he said he came to my bathroom and pulled a knife on him in my bathroom. Dude, the only time I go in my bathroom is a fucking jerk off, dude. Legit. Someone's like with my handy bathroom knife. <laughs> it's like it is the end of an era and it bums me out, dude. We have so many good memories. I love Aaron. No, lo I loved Aaron. I literally would have done anything for Aaron. Anything. Wow. And that's Danny Duncan's side of the story.